Welcome to Data Embassy. Today, I'm going to show you how to steal custom shapes from one workbook to another. Okay, steal is just kidding. It came from the saying that a good artist copy and a great artist steal. Actually, I'm just going to show you how to copy over custom shapes from one workbook to this one. So this chart uh, is showing the world uh, GDP per country. And I would like to add national flags to this chart. And we need to use shapes. However, we do not have the national flags palette in our workbook. So we need to add it, right? But the traditional way of adding it can be a little bit uh, cumbersome. Let's try to find it on the internet. So voila, in Google, by searching World Flags Tableau, I found this workbook. And this is great. Let's see who is the author. So the author is Jury from Denmark. And uh, yeah, I downloaded his workbook here, voila. What we need to do is copy this, okay, and paste it by pointing to a tab in the paste. Voila, we have it here. And uh, so let's have a look at the shape and check out the palette. Note that we have the flex here. So voila. I could have uh, finished here because uh, when you have the palette, you can do whatever you want. So let's go a little bit further. Here we have a field called country and here is a country region. Let's make them the same so that we can blend the two, right? Blend both. And now we can drag this uh, country field from the secondary uh, source and put it in shape. Add all the members. Voila, we have everything here, actually. Let me show you how to make it a little better than this. Press Control key, drag, and uh, minus one make it average and this one we want to make it still a bar chart instead of shape oh. okay that's uh dual axis okay so we still want the shapes we like the blue color And uh, I choose uh, the fixed minus two twenty. Make the shape of the flag a little bigger. Okay. Voila! That's the results we just showed. How to copy over a shape palette from one workbook to another. Instead of uh, using the regular way of uh, creating the shape palette from, uh, from scratch, right? Thanks for watching. Uh, see you at the next video. Uh, if you have any questions, please uh, leave a message. Any of our videos, we will make a video answer for you. Thank you very much. See you next time.